Oh, oh my god. Okay, eat this. Run. This is insane. Oh, run. Oh my god, run, run, run. Oh my god, there's too many of them. Damn, that was crazy. Four crimson heads, holy crap. <laughs>
to my 4K TV, and it's got some weird scan lines on there, like the texture lines. It's not on the PC screen, but on the on my 4K TV it is. Shouldn't be an issue, but if it is, we'll have to fix it for the next episode. Trevor's Diary. And I also fixed the uh, reshade issue where it was kind of orange in the last playthrough. Damn. That is also fixed, so this looks a lot better. Got that orange hue. Alright. Dodge? Perfect. That guy stay trying to break through that door. Okay, so long sword to the head, short sword to the chest. Okay. Uh, which one is left? Uh, actually, that go. That's the. That goes up here, right? It's the short sword that's got to go. Okay, so large left, large left, large left. All right, we're about to fight the snake. Let's go. Did that always take that long? Jesus. I'm telling you, it's the door skip mod. <laughs> it just makes everything hyper fast. So when you have to wait for something like that, ugh. All right, so let's go up here. We're going to fight the snake. So I'll shoot him once with a shotgun. And then uh, Richard's going to come save us. So let's get ready for that encounter. Is he still here? There was a zombie trying to bust through this door earlier, wasn't there? I'm okay. The others... You sure you're okay, man? You look pretty rough. He's resting peacefully in a zombie-infested mansion. Okay, so everybody here is dead. Uh, any ammo here? No. Okay. Payback time. Oh, he got wrapped up. Don't bite me. Damn it. Am I poisoned? No. That was cheap. That was super cheap. Alright, so let's get this. Does Barry come and save me? What do I have to do to have Barry come save Jill right here? Oh my god. Oh my god, this snake. Alright. <laughs> I better not die. <laughs> I'm gonna grab his shotgun and leave. Richard. Richard! Is Yawn always this aggressive? I've never gotten hit by him that many times. So what we'll do is we'll actually um, kite him around. So we'll go down here. I I'm going to use the D-pad because the analog... I can't afford for the analog to mess me up here. Alright, so you do that. Thank you, Yawn. Go this way. Got the shotgun. Oh! Faster! Go, 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 go! Oof. Barry, to the rescue? Oh, am I poisoned? I need serum. Damn it, I gotta go myself. Uh, are there any enemies left? Oh, left. Okay. I wonder what you have to do. If you know what it is, please put it down in the comments below. I would love to, next time we run this, to uh, get poisoned intentionally so we get to see that berry cutscene. Because I've never really seen that cutscene. Okay, so no one's here. I really don't remember what's here. We're going to have to go get the, um, the healing items, the herb. From the outside. Yeah, I hear a zombie, so just to be safe, we'll do this. Okay. 
I wonder if you have to use the serum. Can you go through the game like this? I mean, obviously, it's not ideal, but... Uh, okay. Lunge, miss. Let's get the hell out of here. Alright. Serum, here we come. I wonder why these guys aren't Crimson Heads. Okay, so let's... Use that. I want to go through the other hallway just for scientific reasons. Um, let's do it. Let's do it. I want to see how bad it is. So let's put this away. Um, get all the death masks. Let's see. This one. Isn't there one in a, in a jewel box or something? Where is it? I guess I have to go. I guess I have to go get it. Um, so much for that. Okay, so let's. Yeah, okay, I can still do it. Let's go um, check for science reasons. Okay, I got a couple of daggers. Oh, is there a guy right here? Okay. You know what? I changed my mind. I'm too scared. What we'll, we'll, what we'll do is um. <laughs> we'll uh, we'll save it after we get the death mask, and then we'll go venture and see what's in that damn room. Okay, let's see. Oh, God, these controls. All right, so we gotta go over here, through here. Nothing's trying to break through. Okay. Never mind. So I guess I can take this. Okay, so it's right here. So we have all the death masks. Okay, here we go. All right, so I uh, I'll, I'll save it. I'm I'm I am curious how many crimson heads are in that other hallway. So let's do this. Go down here. Okay. Let's see here. Uh, that is actually all we need. So let's just take this. Save it real quick. Okay, let's go see how bad that hallway is. We've saved it. I'm just curious. Run! Oh my god! Three. Ooh, run, run! Four. Damn, it's four crimson heads. <laughs> what about these hunters out here? Uh, they still can't do anything. Okay. Go, Jill, go! Run! Oh! Oh my god! Okay, eat this. Run! This is insane! Oh, run! Oh my god, run, run, run! Oh my god, there's too many of them! Damn, that was crazy. Four crimson heads, holy crap. <laughs> All right, for real this time. Let's uh, put this ink ribbon away. We're gonna put the. Yeah, sure. I'll, I'll use the taser. I think the taser. You bait him into a grab, and then you get him with the taser, and the handgun should be enough to kill him. So let's. Sounds like a plan. Just gotta avoid this guy. Oh, doesn't this take a key? Oh, okay. Ooh, I have no idea who came in here, but um, I think this is purple, right? So it's. Orange. Okay, so it's this one and the two over here, if I remember correctly. Okay, green. Okay, okay, okay. And then this is... Um, the necklace has to be purple. Perfect. Yeah, that memory. Will you press it? Yes. Get me the hell out of here. The last mask is right here. You see, in Chris's game, you have to have a small key for this part or it doesn't work. So let's do that. Get the lock. Get, get us out of here. Hopefully these guys have despawned. They have. Okay. So let's go over here. Man, I hope one day we can understand this game like we do the OG RE1, 2, and 3 so we can make some crazier mods with this. 
and have you know more enemies and stuff like that but for now this is what we got okay uh, I think it's the eyes right uh, the eyes uh, this is the mask with nothing right up oh. It's probably the one that's in here. Um, sunlight, so the sun is heart. And what is it? It's this. Okay. Yes, death mask, we will use that. Such a cool fight. I wish he was a little bit harder, but you know, he's just a zombie, just a crimson head nose. And right here. Okay. It's funny, if you're Chris, you just shove the flash grenade in his mouth and he dies <laughs> instantly. And one of the perks of being Chris. The extra two item slots mean too much to be doing that. Okay, so let's uh, let's finish this guy off real quick. All right, let's go. I need, I need, I need a grab, grab, do your grab. Nope, nope. Come on, dude. Come on, come on. No, come on. Oh, he just did it. Nope. Oh, that was close. Come on, man. Are we gonna do this all day? No. <laughs> He's being uncooperative. Okay. Okay. Didn't have to take a hit from you, man. Oh my God! Everything's going, everything's going wrong. Okay. I don't believe you're dead. Okay. Now you're dead. That could have gone a little bit smoother. Didn't have to take uh, those two hits, but whatever. Oh, it's only handgun ammo. That's pretty cool. Okay. Yes. All right. Let's go. All right, so I think we're good. Everything after this should be normal. I don't think there's going to be any extra enemies or anything. Can you imagine there being, like, multiple zombies in rooms at the residence area? That would be crazy. In those narrow-ass rooms. It will actually force you to, like, use some ammo to kill them. Like I said, one of these days, I hope uh, the modding scene on this game gets to where the PS1 originals were. So we could do all that cool stuff. All right, so... Oh, regular zombie. Where did he come from? Weren't there, like, four crimson heads in the other room? Where did you come from? That was a weird skip. What the hell was that? Okay. Okay, shotgun shells. Good, good. We're gonna need this for when we come back to the mansion. Uh, oh, a taser. Okay. I don't know where else we're going to use that taser. That's just an extra defensive item. Okay. Uh, I think it's west, right? Uh, yes. Okay. And the other guy should be north. Barry? Monster! Chains! Gun? Ineffective! It's it! Stay away! Forest outside mansion! Stay! Away. <laughs> Stay away! Now, nah, we're gonna go straight into danger, Barry. That's how we do it here. Uh, north. God damn it. <laughs> One cycle. Oh my gosh. Okay, one more time. Yes. Okay. Damn, you know what I forgot? I forgot the Magnum. We're gonna have to get it on our way back. <laughs> it's supposed to bring the uh, the crest, but we can get that on the way back. Let's run past all these damn crows.
so scary. Yeah, Lisa was a great addition to the game. I just wish she had more like um, cool attacks. You know, she just kind of bashes you with her hands, and I was kind of hoping she had like uh, a death move, like the tyrant does, to make her more fearsome. But you know, she she is immortal, so I guess that works. Nothing. I hope we can avoid this hit here because there's some dogs coming up that I kind of want to kill. I really want to kill them because they're super annoying. Oh, I didn't even have to grab that. Okay, so let's get the uh, crank. Okay. I can put everything away now. Um, I'm probably going to throw the handgun away as well. So let's... I don't, I don't need that. Let's throw that away. Throw that away. Do I have another... Um... Oh. That key's still here. Uh, there's the handgun bullets. Handgun. Handgun. Ooh, how am I going to kill the plant? I'm going to have to shoot him with the handgun. Or make the V-jolt, but I haven't done that in so long that I don't even know how to do it. Um, we need, there we go, we need the wind crest. Um, I should probably save that herb, right, in case we get a red one. And what about those doggos? Should we kill them? Uh, yeah, we're gonna kill them. They're so damn annoying. Where's the, uh, shotgun at? There we go. Alright, we're all good to go. Lisa, please! Oh, the camera angle kind of screwed me right there, but we recovered. Let's get the hell out of here. That'd be so cool if she was a stalker enemy, right? The, in the Mr. X style? That'd be pretty dope. Oh, uh, the camera angles are messing me up, so I'm gonna switch the D-pad here. Uh, excuse me. Man, like this right here, this looks great. Can you can you believe this is a GameCube game? Damn, this looks great. Oh my god. Okay, so it should be still crows, right? So let's go get the Magnum. Please don't attack me. Okay. Uh, okay. I want to just shoot those dogs with the Magnum, but we're going to need them. We need every last round. I think I gotta examine all these, right? Yeah. So let's examine this. I forgot what this puzzle was in the original. It was, um, I think you needed these to get out of the mansion, right? I think that's what it was. And the Magnum, um, I don't even know where you find the Magnum in there. Oh, gee. I might have to do a playthrough of that. <laughs> RE1 Director's Cut with the crazy music. I have to. Uh,. I think I have it on my PS3. I'm gonna have to boot up my yes, my my old. Oh my God, get away! Yeah, my old PS3. It still got PS1 classics on there, so <laughs> I'm gonna have to boot that uh, ancient piece of tech up. Yes, yes, the Magnum. All right, let's get the hell out of here. Hmm, these guys uh, spawn into zombies. Well, zombies take their spot later, so I wonder if it's going to be Crimson Heads. Is this still technically the mansion? No. Yes? No? Guess we'll find out soon enough. Oh, I hate this part. I hate the, I hate the dogs in this game. They're just so annoying. They have too much health, and they're just super, super annoying. Okay, let's get the shotgun out. I don't hear anything. This is Brad. If you can hear me, just give me a sign. Anything. Jill to Brad. Can you hear me? Shit. It's broken. Now I hear him. Did they just spawn in? 
He's right in the way. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, he saw me. All right. Who wants them? Doggos. Okay. Next. I killed the one behind him. Okay. Dang. <laughs> that shotgun. Oh, my God. Oh, I forgot. I thought the Magnum. I thought I ran fast with the Magnum, too. But it's still got the default animation. Okay. Let's use the crank here. You know what? That's the greatest use of three shotgun shells ever in this game. Getting rid of some damn Cerberus dogs. You can hear the sound of a waterfall in the distance. Alright. We're good. We're good. Even this. This looks so amazing. I always want, wanted another remake of this game. Third person. Come on. It would be sick. Revamped visuals. RE2 remake style of gameplay. Defensive items. Crimson heads. Oh my god. That will be awesome. Stupid crows. Oh my god. Run. Okay. Alright. We have to run fast, Jill. So put this away. No herbs. Snakes. Residence! Residence! Okay, um... What's the first thing we have to do? Spider room, I think, right? Spider room, and then, um... Uh, I don't even remember. We're just gonna have to go. I'm gonna need that, because on our way back, I always get poisoned. Uh, oh. Do we... What's... What items are in the next room? I think we need three slots, so let's... Push this real quick to prevent the uh, Plant 42 from strangling us, and then we'll go. Is that far enough? Okay. Okay, good, good. I couldn't tell. It, you know, everything kind of blended in right there. Okay, so that's there. Let's go head up the spider room. Um, is there a green herb over here? There is. Damn. Okay, let's see. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, but just enough. Perfect. So we'll take this. We'll take the book. Bandage with blood. I think that's it. Up top is the puzzle thing that you have to do for Vigil that I don't know how to do. Next playthrough, we'll do it. When we do the hard mode of the double enemies. Um, spider, can you get out the way? Oh, oh. Perfect. Um, taser, okay. We actually have a bit of, um, we have a lot of defensive items. I can use them here. Uh, this is ink ribbon, I'll grab that later. Uh, let's see what this is. Green and blue, one green, one blue, okay. So let's put this away. I wish this had the auto sort option that <laughs> Remake has. Uh, RE2 Remake has. Uh, all right, put this away, put this away. I don't think we need any items. We're not going to be shooting anybody, right? So let's put everything away. Um, we're going to have to come back, right? Uh, how, do we, how do we make this very efficient? I think all I need is this. Yeah. I have a route planned. Let's hope this works. All right, so we're going to go up here. Yeah, the thing about these mods is they haven't done anything to the enemies in the residence or the lab, I don't think. And unless it's the randomizer, I might have to get into that to see how that works. But uh, I wish you could put more enemies like in this place, the lab, the catacombs. Kasim? How did Wester get out of this? Did he climb down the bookshelf?
for some reason, I remember this scene on the GameCube version, and it must be because the resolution was sub HD, but Jill had like white eyes. It was like freaking scary. Oh my god, it was super scary. Jill. Barry, I heard someone talking. Oh, you heard. I think age is starting to take its toll. Talking to myself is becoming a bad habit. Talking to yourself? You all right? What's gotten into you? I'm yeah, I see that green thing on Jill's hair. <laughs> but don't come on. I guess this creepy mansion has gotten to my nerves. Anyway, I think I'll go outside, get some fresh air for a change. Damn. <laughs> don't worry. I'm just going to get some fresh air. If I'm lucky, I'll get to waste some monsters along the way. You have a lot more ammo than me, Barry. All right, uh, let's see what's in here. Did that zombie come in already? All right, so we gotta do this. Yeah, he's here. Damn it! Oh well. I might, I might just kill him. It'll be pretty annoying to um, stab him with the dagger. And then when I come back, I'm going to stab him again because I have to run through that narrow-ass corridor. I don't know how the speedrunners do it, man. They run right by that dude. Okay, let's go through here. Uh, we need the suicide gun. There we go. I don't know if that's if it's the case in the in this remaster. But in the original, you can kill, like, everything in one shot with this gun. Should we save it for Tyrant? We probably should, but I'm gonna end up using it, probably. What's in here? I think this is the key. Yeah, it's gotta be here. There we go. Oh. Peace out, guys. It's a shame you never have to encounter these guys ever again. <laughs> It would be so sinister if you had to, if you had to come back. I think we have, four slots is enough, right? Um, let me think. Uh, we're we're going to go straight to fight the plant, so we're going to have to set up. You know, I should use this against the plant. That's a great idea. Handgun... Would 15 handgun shots and the self-defense gun be enough? Because we're getting some ammo downstairs and a key, so two slots are taken. We'll come back. We'll come back. I, I don't want... We've done a lot. I don't want to die. Or get to the plant. I'd be unable to kill him. Can you leave that room if you can't kill him? I don't know if you can. So we'll, we'll go do all the shark stuff. And then we'll come back and kill the damn plant. Alright, let's go. Ah, oh, I should have brought, should have brought the, the handgun. Run! Oh my god, I don't know how I did it. That was all squirrely. I was using my analog stick and things just happened. Okay, now I'm using D-pad. <laughs> Hurry, Jill! Like, if this guy was a crimson head, you'd have to kill him because he'd be too fast. Oh, I love this song. I wonder, um, I wonder what song it was during, in the original. For some reason, I can't remember the soundtrack of the underwater area. I definitely have to go back and replay that game. <laughs> the only thing is, if we play mods for that, I, I really suck at old school RE. We're going to have to struggle through it. This isn't so bad until we start mixing and matching mods. And then we'll see. I think just playing the double mods on hard mode would be super difficult. I did the playthrough on normal, and you know that that was you know, that was decent, decent difficulty spike. But if there were double enemies and crimson heads, woof. or if there was a like an enemy randomizer, like for just enemies, because I I don't like the door randomizers, because. <laughs> Uh, I'm, I suck at that kind of stuff, inventory management. But if it was just enemy, uh, enemy randomizers, I can do that. Go faster, Jill. 
must get through this spot. Okay. Yeah, it's so cool how much they expand this from the original. I think in the original it was like a square area with like four doors. <laughs> That's all it was. <laughs> and you get this and it's a whole like underwater uh, underwater ring. Alright. No analog sticks here. The camera angle gets kind of squirrely. Run! Shark! Please don't! Please don't! Please don't! Please don't! Okay. Jill, run faster. You must go faster. He's coming. Go, 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 go. I think we're good. Oh, shit. Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. Alright. There we go. I wonder if the giant shark, can he kill you if you're up there at the door? Or do you have to be, like, on the sides? And is there anything up there? I might have to... I mean, I kind of want to check, but we we got to go quick. Uh, number two. Okay. Let's shut this place down. Neptune! Emergency. Unknown source of pressure detected. Locking all doors to achieve maximum safety. Okay. Um, what do we have to do? We have to talk to this, right? Safety. So the safety is right here. Okay. Okay. Reaching you know, like it'd be so cool if they ever remade this game and there was a section um, of just water, like RE4, <laughs> and then you could shoot into the water like the Delago, and it comes and eats you for a trophy. That's so, that's so awesome. Uh, oh damn! Chill out. Chill out. Chill out. Number two. Um, which which switch is next? It's the same. F oh my god. Okay. I think it's this one. Oh, okay, so we'll talk to safety again. Damn, you don't get a lot of time at all. Look at that. Okay, you do that. You do this. And we're good. We've defeated all the sharks. Pull the lever, Jill. Since this is hard mode, I wonder how much ammo we're going to get in this area. Oh, man, I'm telling you, whenever the camera angle changes and then you're using the analog stick, <laughs> your character just loses all control of themselves. Okay, what's over here? Beyond use. Oh, nothing. Okay, so there's nothing over here. I wonder if there's still the magnum bullets by the stairs. Or by the ladder. I've also seen a lot of people, the speedrunners, just run right by this guy and grab the key. <laughs> I can't. You made it this far, and this is how, you, and this is how your run dies. I could never do it. Okay. You can also use the self-defense gun. It kills him in one shot. At least in the GameCube version. I don't know about the remaster. Okay, so he did. All right, Mr. Shark is dead. Let's grab this. I just love this whole area. It's so awesome. I don't think they're ever going to remake this game, but if they do, man, and they expand on this area right here, oh my goodness. This area already looks so cool. Like, look at this. Like, this looks <laughs> good enough to be um, like a PS4 game. Oh, no Magnum bullets here either. Ooh, we're really strapped for ammo, guys. It's a good thing uh, we got all these defensive items. I mean, we've only killed like what, like three enemies plus the dogs. That's about it. And the hunters will have to kill also. But I have acid rounds for that. So we might have to use the self-defense gun on the plant. Yeah, that's that's probably for the best to be safe. All right, how are we gonna dodge this guy? See, like, ugh, the camera angle. I swear. All right, let's try a dodge here. Oh, whatever. Like, how did people dodge him on the GameCube days where you didn't have the analog control to make you super fast like this? Okay. Yeah, we're gonna have to come back and. Um, 
go to the item box, get some guns to kill this thing. There's a red herb right here. I don't know how much ammo it takes. We're going to have to... Oh! We'll probably save it. Um, just to be safe. Because I want to use the least amount of ammo possible. Okay. So I'll shoot him with a self-defense gun, then I'll shoot him with the handgun. I don't know how much... Um, I don't think that'll be enough. Just thinking, just thinking about it right now. If we played on the regular difficulty, we would have the flame rounds, which just melt that dude. But we don't have any. How are we gonna kill the spider in the um, <laughs> in the cave without the flame rounds? Oh my goodness! All right. Time to load up. Okay, so. We'll need the book. Um, we'll take a herb with us. I think we're going to have to play it safe. We'll do the... Um, oof, this is tough. We'll do the grenade launcher. Self-defense gun. And the pistol. Okay. So I'll shoot once with the self-defense gun, three grenade rounds, and the rest is going to be all handgun shots. And that, hopefully that's enough. Um, let me see here. Okay, we're, we're ready to go. Uh, ah, ink ribbon on the thing. Okay, so we're going to open up with um, this. Okay. Ink ribbon. This should allow us to save at least a little bit of ammo. Okay, let's put this way back in the box. I think we're still looking good. I mean, we don't have much ammo for the power guns, but if we just run past everything, we should be good to go. Man, I'm just thinking about how things would have went on the other run with this amount of ammo. It'd be super challenging. We'd have to be <laughs> uh, spamming the defensive items every time we got grabbed. All right, let's kill all these bees right here. Oh my god, no! Does this kill the ones that's in this room? It does not. Oh my god, I did not even want to check that. <laughs> Alright. They're all dead. I got one slot, two slots, perfect. Grab the key and get ready for the boss fight. Remember, it used to just come here with the flame rounds and shoot like two or three and that thing would just die. Oh boy. Alright, let's see what we got here. I don't think there's anything in that bathroom. I remember checking it. I think it was like an ink ribbon or something. But I, last, last time I played, the last playthrough of the other mod... There was nothing in there, so... Uh, this goes here. This goes over here. And then... Oh, I messed up. Switched it to at the top. Okay. Here we go. Here's the plant boss fight. Let's hope we've prepared correctly. What? Oh. <laughs> What? I swear it was correct. What the hell? Okay. Now we start for real. Alright, run, Jill, run. So we're gonna wait for him to open up, shoot him with this, and then the grenade launcher. There it is. Okay. Ooh. Um. One, two. Does that mean he's dying? This cutscene right here? There's three. Um, I'm gonna have to keep running around right until he opens up. Stop swinging your arms at me. Ooh. Okay. I don't know how to quick shoot, so I can't quick shoot this guy. So just stay here and just empty this clip into him. Oh my god. 
Die! Uh oh. Uh, how many shots I got left? Two? Dang, is there somewhere you can stand? Re can't hit you? Uh oh. Uh, uh. Okay. <laughs> I don't want to risk it. We're getting hit too much. Uh, that didn't go well, but at least we saved two grenade launcher rounds. Yeah. What was that? That was four grenade launcher rounds, a magnum shot from the defense gun, and like a clip. I wonder if there's a place you can just stand to avoid everything, but... I'm gonna shoot y'all. Look at that. Jill has you in her sights, guys. <laughs> Put your hands up. Uh, okay, I thought I was danger, but I think I have a double green in the box we can use before we head back to the mansion and face the hunters. So we're good. We got the residence done. Now let's go out here and meet Captain Wesker, who somehow disappeared from the other room. Wesker. This track is good too. This track is really good. Jill, so you're safe. That's what I was going to say. <laughs> I apologize. Jill, what the hell are you so doing, Jill? Who do does that? Who does that motion? Creatures. I understand. Anyway, it's good that you're safe. Did you notice? Barry, you sounded a little flaky. Now that you mention it, yeah. I'll keep a close eye. Maybe it's quite natural under the circumstances. It's not really our standard operation. Jill, our first priority is to get out of here. I agree. There are still rooms in that mansion we can't get into because they're locked up. I've been looking for ways to... Okay, if there's anything, I'll go back to the other mansion. I'm counting on you. And he just disappears. Damn, Wesker. Oh, sorry, bees. <laughs> uh, let's just split up again, guys. Let's just split up. It's the... That's how horror initiates itself. All right, let's see here. Um, we're gonna fight a hunter, right? So I'm gonna bring the shotgun. Um, this is now useless. We don't need this. We don't need this. I'll bring the acid rounds. Actually, that's what I need. I need the acid rounds and, and the handgun. That's all I need. There should be enough to kill all three hunters that we're about to encounter. Where's the double heal? Double green. There it is. Ink ribbon. Alright, so let's heal up. And, uh... Do we have to kill anything on the way back? Let me think real hard. Um, no, but I'm probably gonna get poisoned. So let's take that blue herb. And this is where we're gonna leave off. I got six acid rounds for the hunters. And then I have the blue herb because I always get poisoned at this part. And then the snake is next, so... Let's go save it. We did good. We did good all the way here. Uh, didn't have to use that many items. Crimson Head Hallway was crazy with like four of those guys. That's insane. Good thing you don't have to go to that spot. But I wish you kind of did so you'd have to go in there and maybe waste some ammo or something. Um, but maybe in another mod uh, a little bit down the line here. So let's save it here. All right. Number four, Resident Storeroom. And we are all set, guys. That's going to be it for today. Thank you all for tuning in. Please leave a like and a subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next one.